Mr. Warburg, hello. How are you, sir? I'm very well. Welcome to Britain. Thank you. I was just asking outside if you've ever shot here, but I don't think I don't think you have. We did we did some additional shoots uh, for Planet of the Apes here at uh, Pinewood Studios. Yes. Well, Two Guns is uh, I think the the action movie of the year. I think it's so fun. Oh, well, thank you. It's brilliant. However, when I saw Two Guns, I was thinking it might be a fitness DVD of you just just pumping out <laughs> the bicep curls for two hours. Maybe that would be the next Two Guns. Another two guns that will do that. Well, you could, and you could just say, you know, if it was a fit, you say this week we're doing the arms. Next week, just getting the, the Mark Wahlberg arms. Oh. <laughs> exactly. Now you and Denzel have great chemistry in this film. In the movie, you're kind of a hothead, and he's the cool guy. Was it a similar setup in in real life for you? Uh, I I have a tendency to get crazy every once in a while, but no, I'm I'm a pretty laid back guy. I think we're we're very similar in that you know we're blue collar guys that, you know take what we do very seriously, but not necessarily take ourselves all that seriously. Um, and it was great for me to work with a guy who's, you know, done so much and been through so much that I could kind of pick his brain and get advice from him, both personally and professionally. You clearly, like, love each other in the movie as friends. It's, there's almost a brotherly aspect to it as well. And, like, with all those relationships, mm -hmm. you know, you fight, then you make up. And there's some really funny fight scenes in it, with the, where, especially the, the scene on the ground where you got, got each other in a headlock. Did mm -hmm. it ever get a bit... You know how play fights can sometimes turn a bit? Yeah. You, you get a bit into it? Yeah, no, no. You know, it was one of those things where the, the director was really concerned. He was like, oh my God, I'm going to deal with this fight with you and Denzel. Both of you guys are going to want to win. You know, it could get crazy. And I was like, dude, I'm no, I'm easy. I don't care whatever you want to do. And Denzel came up with the idea of it, like just being like two little kids, like how, you know, neither one of them wants to let each other go. No one wants to be the first one to quit or give up. So, so we'll just kind of let each other go at the same time. And then we just kept playing it with him, playing with it. But no, neither one of us was all that happy about rolling around in the dust for 16 hours. Yeah, it works well. But at the end of that day, you ever have a pinch yourself moment? You're thinking, I just got paid for a day of just of just messing around with Denzel Washington. Yeah, you can't help but think that, you know. Um, but I do that with 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 pretty much every other movie that I make too, because I get to do something that I enjoy so much, and you know, I'm actually getting paid for it, and you know, it's 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 a it's a pretty rare thing. And there's a ton of action, but there's a lot of comedy in it as well. And I have noticed in your career, especially in the last sort of five to ten years, you um you combine them like in this film, the comedy and the action. But you've you've got very good um, timing, dry dry sense of humor. Mm -hmm. Do you have a preference? Do you, do you do you find them? Do you like being the hard man or the comedy guy, or do you like blending them like in this film? Uh, it was fun blending them. I like doing it all. You know, um, it's funny because right after Two Guns, I went and did a movie called Lone Survivor, which is a very serious true story of uh, Marcus Luttrell and the worst tragedy in the history of the Navy SEALs. And uh, and it was very, and Two Guns was very different from Pain and Gain, you know, where it was dark and a lot of humor, but a very different subject matter and tonally just kind of dark. And, uh, <clears throat> but yeah, I like to mix it up, but I, I think it's a good way, because I don't think I just, I don't think you'll ever see me doing like Pratt Falls and stuff like that. Uh, that kind of comedy. Mm. I think I try to base it all in a realistic way. Like everything that I do, I have the same approach, whether doing comedy or drama. You know, I just try to make it as real as possible. Whether this guy's just completely off the wall, or I'm hanging out with a teddy bear smoking weed, whatever it is, I'm just gonna try to play it real. And you're a family man, so as a family man, are you are you more the the action dad, or are you kind of kind of comedy dad? Uh, no, I'm probably more the action dad. You know, my my wife got my kids thinking now that I'd never laugh, right? So, which is not true, you know, but uh, but they laugh constantly. So if I don't laugh at everything that they say, then I just have no sense of humor whatsoever. But uh, but my sons and, and my daughters, we, we do a lot of physical activity, so I play a lot of sports, and that's it, more the action, Dad.